Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Today, I would like to talk about the Troyan Windsor 2 ZNIM, a detection of Microsoft Defender you could have seen in your system. This detection refers to its backdoor malware with some specific properties. In this video, I will explain what Windsor 2 ZNIM is, why it appears, and how to remove it from the system. So, what is this Troyan Windsor 2 ZNIM? According to Virustatal, this detection refers to a backdoor malware, specifically to a deeply obfuscated one. Among specific examples, I found some well-known malware names like Peekabot, Gulloader, and Ramcas Red. Such malicious programs usually aim at establishing unauthorized remote access to the system to further perform DDoS attacks or deploy other malware. These backdoors are known for forming large botnets that are further rented to the best bidder on the darknet. When deployed in targeted attacks, such backdoors may be used for compromising the environment and starting cyber attacks. The actual question is, can ZNIOM be a false positive? Well, never say never, but as far as my research goes, there was not even a single situation where this detection was false positive. Even though Microsoft Defender is not always 100% accurate, it should adhere to its detections and double-check everything. But where could this malware came from? Well, there are a lot of malware infiltration channels, but for backdoors, they boil down to email spam. If you open the attachment of a questionable email, and follow the instructions in it, this could be the source of a backdoor malware in your system. Now it is obvious that Windsor 2 ZNIAM is an exceptionally dangerous thing to have in your system. To remove it, I recommend using Gradient Soft and Time Malware. This effective program is capable of removing any malware, even the sophisticated one like ZNIAM. Let's launch a full scan and give it time to finish. When the scan is over, click Clean Out to remove all the detected items. The removal may also take a minute or two depending on the number of detections, as the program should remove all the hooks the malware creates to achieve persistence. Now the system is clean. Good luck and stay safe online.